Hello and welcome to CRA Diecast for another Diecast unboxing. It was actually today's video is on a mail call. I did uh, order a few castings from a company in the States called Awesome Diecast, so that arrived today. It's about uh, six or seven castings that I ordered, so we'll crack that open and have a look. So just bear with me. Hope all my subscribers are doing well. It's a beautiful day here in Adelaide, so I thought I'd do an unboxing outside. Oops. Crack it open. Let's see what I got. I, I know I got a couple of castings that I remember, a couple of Cadillacs, but I uh, can't think what else I've ordered, so that'll be interesting. This one this is from Shelby Collectibles. It's this really nice black and yellow 2008 Shelby Terlingua Mustang. Uh, oh. Terlingua Racing Team. Okay. So. Crack that open and see what it looks like. Uh, it's a nice gloss black paint. Nice decal on the hood. Looks like some sort of lion or something. Inserted brake lamps. Shelby badge. Twin side mirrors and an opening hood. With that probably a 5 litre V8 back in 2008. Well, it could be the modular 4.6. Lens headlamps, tempoed indicators, nice rims, nice chrome five slots. Mm. Real rubber tyres. Oh yeah, she rolls perfectly. And then from Johnny Lightning from their pop culture, we got this uh, 77 Pontiac Fiber Trans Am, in like a gloss black, like Smokey and a Bandit. So we'll crack that one open. I 
like it's part of their Trivial Pursuit series. Comes with a little medallion. This is awesome. Gloss black, same as the Shelby. Got nice gold rims. T-tops and the chicken logo on the hood and the shaker metal body metal base real rubber tires and hopefully yep she runs nicely I think they're painted headlamps Hard to tell. Could be tempered brake lamps. Yeah, this is awesome. Got quite a few of these. From Green Lights, a 72 Cadillac Coupe de Ville with a vintage gas pump. It's from their Hobby Shop Series 13. They love these big caddies. This one looks nice in this pale blue. So we'll crack that open. That looks beautiful. Big boat, got the white walls, the chrome hubcaps, black interior, chrome around the door frames and windows, big bold grill on the front, little bumper overriders on the bumper bar, painted headlamps, and you see the Cadillac crest. Looks like the hood opens, but it actually doesn't. I don't think. No. No. Nicely done brake lamps. Cadillac, Cadillac uh, script. This one rolls. It's a real mobster car. This one is gorgeous. I got another 72 Coupe de Ville in gold from Greenlight. And they make a nice pair. There's gold with a white top.
Same as the other one, the nice wide white walls, black interior, gorgeous gold paint. Yeah, stunning. She's a big car. I'll put them side by side. And the next one is also a Cadillac, this time it's a 72 Cadillac Sedan Deville, so it's a four-door in silver. So we'll crack that. of a scuff on the roof but yeah this is a real mobster car this one should be black got sedan to build script on the rear roof pillar chrome on the brocker panels chrome around the door frames and windows and that big huge Cadillac grill everyone it's un unmistakable. And then the nice tail lamp details. And, and she actually rolls really nicely. And from Auto World, a 1970 Chevy Impala Custom Coupe in like a metallic blue with a white roof. This one's got an opening hood. Oh yeah, 350 cubic inch. Painted headlamps and indicators. Big Chevy grill. And of course, chrome hubcaps and uh, white walls. Blue interior. And wheels look a little bit small for the car. Unless it's a low rider. I don't think so. But, uh, triple tail lights at the back. Chrome bumper. Concave rear glass. But yeah, that's a uh, nice casting. I'm a real fan of the GM cars from the 70s and 60s. Well, most American cars. And then something a little bit different from Johnny Lightning. It's the um, Aston Martin DB5 from the movie No Time to Die. And this one's got all of the bullet holes and damage on the vehicle. I thought that was uh, quite unique. Um, crack that one open. I do like the old Aston Martins. This one's in birch silver like it should be. You can see all of the bullet holes and scrapings down the side. Chrome wire wheels, 
This is a lot of bullet holes in it. And it's painted brake lamps and reversing lights. Sunroof or ejector seat. Twin rear view mirrors. Nice chrome grill. Right hand drive. You can see the wooden steering wheel. Geez, a lot of damage on this car. Yeah, I do like this. And she rolls. No wheel issues, which is good. And then while I was out today picking up this parcel, I did uh, call in and I did pick up a couple of new Hot Wheels. It's the uh, Porsche 935 in metallic blue. 75th anniversary of Hot Wheels. I won't open it. And then the Volvo Drift in metallic green. Unfortunately, it's not the treasure hunt. But yeah, I do like this casting. And then a 1980 El Camino in uh, green. So, I'll just do a bit of a recap. I've got that 2008 Shelby. A really nice black 77 Trans Am. Then the trio of 72 Cadillacs. The 1970 Impala. And they're really nice Aston Martin. So thanks for dropping by. I really appreciate it. If you appreciate the video, hit the thumbs up and share and subscribe. It would be appreciated. And we'll catch you on my next video. So thanks very much and bye for now.